All right, so today is day 253. Been raising up these two little red tail catfish for 253 days. Posting videos every day on YouTube so you can see how fast they grow. And I actually had a couple comments lately. They're like, hey, why aren't your two red tail catfish growing faster? <laughs> That's a good question. I've seen some people report incredible growth on these red tail catfish. And I've seen some people where they, they have even slower growth. So it's kind of interesting that uh, they've only gotten about nine inches over 253 days, where some people thought they should be a lot bigger than that. So I'm not sure why. Uh, one reason is maybe because I'm not overfeeding. So that's the thing with these red tails. I've, I've actually had a lot of people say, hey, my red tail catfish died from overeating which is a big problem. So I'm trying not to feed too much to where they get really super bloated and potentially could die. But if you actually watch my videos, at the end of every video, I kind of show you kind of the belly of the catfish and they're definitely getting some fat bellies. <laughs> and they're doing great. They're just not growing as fast as I thought they would grow, which is pretty wild kind of surprising so I guess they're growing maybe what an inch a month or something like that I've seen some people say that they can grow two or three inches a month if you really super feed them but you really have to be careful they say the number one cause of death for red tailed catfish is overeating so I've been kind of trying to limit the food to where they get a belly but they're not like look like they're gonna blow up <laughs> And sometimes they still do look like they're going to blow up. There's been a couple times where it was like way too much food, just way too much. And it's hard with two fish too, because uh, trying to get enough food to both of them without one of them overeating, I'd say that's kind of the tricky part too. Especially doing a lot of hand feeding. It seems like this one right here, this orca twin, these are the orca twins. <laughs> I still haven't given them names, but it seems like this guy is uh seems like he gets most of the food the other one's coming up a lot though today we're almost running out of food already <laughs> we're doing all pretty much all hand feeding on this one and he's getting a little belly already oh he missed it he missed it all right see if i can give this other one a little bit more here this guy needs to eat some more mm. <laughs> we'll see if we'll come up <laughs> <laughs> well, we'll see. It's kind of hard to, to balance the food between the two fish. Especially if you just throw a whole plate of food in there. It seems like one fish seems like it eats a lot more than the other one. So, and this guy does seem like he's getting bigger just because uh, he's uh, like better at hand feeding. All right, let's see if this other guy will come up. Maybe, maybe. All right, last hand feeding. Here we go. Ah, <laughs> look at how big he is. I think they're pretty big. I'm kind of glad they're not much bigger. Because <laughs> then I'd have to think about, all right, I need a bigger hot tub <laughs> to put these guys in. But, so it's kind of interesting. You know, so, uh, the other thing is, I think a lot of people don't know exactly how old their fish are. <laughs> You know, time really flies. I can't believe it's been 253 days. So it seems like maybe a few months where you bought them, it could actually be a lot longer if you're not really keeping track of the time. But you can definitely see already that that one has quite a big belly on them. Some people thought that maybe it was because of the, the, the food that I'm feeding. They thought if I fed like a whole fish like a minnow that they grow faster but i don't know if that'd be the case or not i suppose i could buy some like some frozen minnows or something see if i can feed those of course i'd probably have to wait till they're a little bit bigger i don't know if they're big enough to eat like a whole minnow unless they're really super tiny minnows all right so i want to feed the rest of this just a little bit left this is cod and tilapia all right, so I'm going to finish up with some underwater video.